swimwear bikini set and today I will be doing a haul on seven swimsuits guys seven swimsuits so let's get into it where they will be sexy sleek you know tight in the butt area or what's not so what I'm going to start off with today is my two-piece from icon swimwear the name of it is going to be in the description box below it is called now you see me two-piece bikini set so we're gonna start off from a one to ten what I would rate this swimsuit as I would say mm, so so I give it a seven the reason why I give it a seven is because if you're not really a curvy type of girl or you don't have any hips, you'll really look a little boxy around this area. So especially being that, you know, it has these little two pieces that comes up on the hips. If you don't have any hips, it's just going to look very bland, not juicy, you know, or what's not. And for the bralette part, you know, it's, it's kind of so-so for me. I give it... Um, you know, I just rather, I would have rather it to have a little padding in the breast area for, you know, people with big breasts or pierced nipples, you know, but everyone has a preference. I prefer it to have like a extra piece on the inside, you know, to cover the breast area. Um, for the back part now, the back part is pretty okay. I would say that I wish it came a little more downwards only for the girls, you know, with the big booties because let's let's face it, you know, you can't even do a little Baywatch run on the beach or anything like that because it's going to be in your butt. So you might as well just make the back similar to a thong in my opinion, but everyone has their preference. But for me, I rate this a seven. It is cute. The print is cute. So I would say, yeah, it's a seven for sure. You know, I have six other ones compared to this one and I do have my favorites. So I would say out of all my favorites, I would rate this like the fourth favorite one that I like. Um, I'm not really a fan of two piece swimsuits. So that's the reason why as well that it wasn't up like you let's say one or two you know of my favorites because i'm all a monokini type of chick i don't like two pieces i don't like the little you know the little side and back fat type of thing i like everything snatched as one all right guys we are on to swimsuit number two this is called the go wild monokini again this is my second favorite swimsuits out of the seven that i received and I did get this in a size large. Reason being is because I'm a little tall, so I usually tend to get, you know, wear like between, sometimes depending on the material, I get between a medium to a extra large. Um, in swimsuits, whenever I get monokinis, I usually get them in a size large. Now, the reason why this is my favorite honey is so many things I can tell you guys. Let me tell you. So, I like the little design cut out right here, you know, to show a little cleavage or what's not. And the reason, another reason why I do like this swimsuit is because where it comes here around the hips, it's pretty high cut. So, that's another thing for me. I love high cut swimsuits especially to you know like define your curves and what's not your hips if you want to look a little sexy but cute at the same time the third good thing about this swimsuit that i like is the little design belt that it has you know it latches in the back right here it's kind of cute what's not and then you also have the cutout here and you also have another cutout right here so that's why i really like it it's also a crossover so you know to be honest, it's like a two piece and a one piece and one kind of cute kind of vibes because it has this part cut out. So yes, this is my one of my favorites. I love the print. The print is 
so sexy so cute you know with a little hint of orange or what's not it's not too far off from my skin tone so that's why it's one of my favorites as well i'm not really into bright extravagant colors or what's not i like more of the neutral side so this is why this is one of my favorites you know i wore this on like a boating trip and honey let me tell you i was slaying I was slaying, I was slaying them curves, I was looking cute, what's not, you know, had to flip the hair or what's not, because, yes, honey, it was a vibe. So definitely out of, from a 1 to 10, I rate this swimsuit definitely 10, because, honey, you know, I was slaying, I was looking cute, I was looking cut, or what's not, and yeah, it covers... You know, if you got that little extra pudge to the bottom, you know, still define your little, you know, curve. So what's not, it comes up V-cut. And it doesn't really show too much down in this area here. So that's another reason why I liked it. And yeah, so I would definitely say, guys, if you definitely check out Icon Swimwear, this is one of them you should cop. You should have one of these in your, in your list, honey, period gotta slay okay especially if you're gonna be on a boat or like a um a little trip with your girls and you guys want to wear your swimsuits you gotta slay honey you gotta slay period all right guys so we are back again with another swimsuit this is swimsuit number three this is the pierre perfection swimsuit it's also a two-piece with like a little zebra print on the top and a solid color bottom which would be it's kind of like a it's like a neon orange kind of vibe um okay so i would have to say out of all of the swimsuits this would definitely be my least favorite reason being is because for the bottom area i'm not really too much a fan of the cutout and this part doesn't go like flat I'm very picky when it comes to I'm very picky when it comes to swimsuits especially when it's a two-piece um, again I'm not really too fond of this little area even though I know it was supposed to be a style um, out of a 1 to 10 I would give this I would give it like a 5 to be honest it's just giving me kitty vibes, you know, not really mature, grown, sexy. It's kind of like um, fun in the sun with the kids, you know, type of vibes. Um, around the breast area, it's pretty okay, you know. The only good thing that I could say that I really like about it is for the top area, you know, for the people that get sunburned, you know, very easily, this would kind of work. Um, the back... For the underwear area it's I would say it's pretty okay it's not that bad um you know it's not really too much to say about this one you know because it's not my favorite but yes it is a nice swimsuit overall I do give it like a five to be honest but you know everyone has their preference what works for them me you would never see me really too often gravitating towards a two-piece but for a two-piece the print is kind of cute Maybe the bottom could have been a little different, but it's still a vibe, you know, get some cute shades or what's not with the kids. So yeah, but it's definitely, it's definitely still cute. You know, even if the swimsuits are like a hit and miss, what I can say is that the prints for the swimsuits, they're pretty okay. They're pretty cute. So, you know, cute cells, sexy cells, why not? Hey guys, we are back with another swimsuit. This is swimsuit number four, and this is called the Stripe Me Down Bikini Set. It is in a size medium. The reason why I purchased this in a medium is because my upper body around my waist is a lot smaller than my thighs. So I usually go a size down whenever I'm purchasing high waist, anything, whether it's jeans, underwear, whatever, whatever, a size down. So, yes. Now, in terms of what I would rate it, I honestly would rate it as a, I would give it an eight um, in comparison to my other swimsuits. Um, reason being is because I like the top, you know, it's really 
sleek, sticks to you like a glove type of vibes. No sunburn. You know, it's just, it's just cute. And then for the back of the swimsuit, you know, it covers everything. Of course, anything high waist usually covers everything. So, yeah. So it's definitely a yes for me. It's definitely an eight. So I would say this would be like, maybe my third favorite one. Yeah, it's definitely third. It's cute definitely cute especially for like for moms you know who has that little baby weight high waist underwear and bikinis are always the go-to so yeah I would definitely say it's cute it's a vibe with some cute little you know black sunglasses you know get on your cute status this this doesn't scream boat vibes to me though it doesn't definitely not but it's cute, you know, a little fun in the sun. So, yeah. So now we're gonna go into swimsuit number five. And that is going to be a monokini. So stay tuned, guys. We are going to jump straight in. Guys, we are on to swimsuit number five. This is the high dive monokini. Yes, honey, it is cute. It's definitely a vibe. Out of a one to 10, I would rate this a seven. Reason being is because I don't really care for this little cutout piece right here, only because of how high it is. When it comes to the back, it's not enough coverage for the butt. So maybe if it was going into like a thong bikini, then I would have been like, yeah, that, that's definitely that. But, you know, it just kind of gives me a little vibe like, you know, we're going to make this sexy, but I also look a little confused. But the crutch area, it's pretty okay. Um, it gives you a lot of coverage, you know. What's not? And I like the little crossover that they have to the top. You know, it's definitely cute. A little sleek very stretchy and one thing that i can say about these swimsuits guys is that the material is definitely on the money it, it's definitely a one you're definitely going to get your money's worth and a lot of times icon swimwear they do have a lot of sales so sometimes you know you end up paying ten dollars for a swimsuit so what's really ten dollars just saying what's ten dollars for you know a swimsuit that's good material versus you're paying $15, I mean $25 for a swimsuit that's not good material. So, you know, one thing that I can definitely say about their swimsuits, it's definitely not a hit and miss. It's you're definitely gonna get your butt's worth. Um, for the back, you know, it comes down real, you know, tight. And for the front around the boob area, the only thing that I would say for the boob area, this side, it definitely cups your breasts really really good but on this side you know if you have like a little sag or anything it doesn't really have anything to lift up this side so in most cases if like you're one of those girls that doesn't have like big boobs or what's not I would definitely advise you to take in the side so when you take in the side it gives you that extra like lift that you need versus you know your shit hanging but so yes I would definitely give this a seven and Stay tuned, guys. We're going to jump into the next swimsuit. It's going to be cute. It's going to be hot. It's going to hey be... Hey, guys. We are back with another swimsuit. This is swimsuit number six. This is the Too Faced Monokini. And the reason why this one is one of my favorites is because, honey, let me tell you. Mm, mm, mm. The top part where it crosses over, I really like that because it's, it doesn't make the swimsuit look bland, even though it's like solid colors. It's not a print. So, you know, whenever you have something that's a print, you know, you can make it real simple and it still would be cute versus something being solid and just looking bland. So the idea that the, they have with the concept where they cross over the top, you know, I think that made the swimsuit really come together as one. And for the bottom part, I love the fact how it comes up on the side, very high cut, you know, to give a little emphasis on these. Beyonce hips or whatever and going into the back 
how it's just one solid color but you have the black zipper to match the front as well i don't think people really pay attention to that when they buy swimsuits but i do so yeah and then the back you know it covers pretty much everything you know yes i do have my little mamita rolls or whatever but it's still a vibe you know still makes your bottom look a little oh, juicy. i would definitely say out of one to ten this is definitely a ten period um, this is boating vibes. This is beach vibes. This is chill with your girl vibes, you know, little cute, little fun, what's not. So yeah, I would definitely say this is definitely a go-to. This is the second time I've actually put it on. The first time I wore it, I went to the beach. I had in blonde hair. I had my swimsuit on. I was looking like a little Spanish mommy or what's not. It was very cute, you know, simple, but cute. Um, at, at that time when I did wear it the first time, I had on a little weight, so, you know, it was looking snatched all over, honey, period. Um, yeah, so, it's definitely giving me Beyonce girls tour vibes, you know? Girls, we run this mother. Yes, honey, get into it, get into it. We are at swimsuit number seven. This is the Ride the Wave Monokini. And honey, let me tell you, this is my favorite, period, okay? <sighs> honey, honey. Drum roll, please. Whew, let's take a moment of silence. This is my favorite swimsuit. Out of all of the seven that I received, this is the favorite. I rate this a 10, guys. Let me tell you why. Gives you, you know, Beyonce vibes, a what's not. This swimsuit, I wore it with blonde hair and honey, I was kind of hot yalla, okay. hot yalla, sweet Slay. like a honey. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually go into explaining to you guys why I like this swimsuit and why I rate this as a 10. The reason why I rate this as a 10 is because for the bottom area where the under the panty area is, I would say I love the fact that it goes as a high cut for the more curvy girls or what's not. I love the fact that it has this little cutout right here, you know. It doesn't scream explicit. It doesn't scream show me all of your skin, show me all of your goods. But it still has that little cover up right here where you can cover most of your boobage and then you can have like a little bit of breast popping through just to give it that little sexy vibes. And also for the sides, you know, it comes up really high going into the back. We have a little belt in the back. So the belt, honestly, I didn't think that you really needed the belt. But the reason why I like the belt is because, you know, the back, it zips up right here. And all it has is the cutout, so they added the belt to give it that little extra oomph to it. So it doesn't look so plain in the back, even though the front is screaming sexy. So, yes. This is why I would rate this a 10. So, closing out our video, what I will do is I will list all of the stuff below and the links to the swimsuits that I purchased. Again, in all of my monokinis, I purchased a large and my two-piece swimsuits, I purchased all of those in a medium. The reason being, remember I was telling you guys earlier in the video that whenever I'm getting anything high waist to the bottom, it's always going to be a size down. For monokinis, the reason why I go to a large, which is a size up, is because I'm very tall. So, you know, we gotta have that extra stretch, honey. We gotta, we gotta have it, period. Um, yeah, so I definitely would purchase from Icon Swimmer again. I will stay, keep you guys tuned a little more with more of the swimsuits that I get from them. And I will also link all of their links below to the bottom, as well as pricing and sizes. So you guys can check it out. Um, I would highly recommend this. I would recommend it to anybody, baby, even for the big girls, because it's just, it's a vibe. It's, 
it screams Baywatch. It screams like you're running down the beach, you're swinging your hair, you know, and you're jumping. That's the vibe I get. So Icon Swimwear is where it's at, and I will definitely post some of my little clips from my little boating trip and when I wore the swimsuit so you can get a feel of how it looks just outside of the hall. So it's not going to be, oh, where were you? we're just going to look at her videos and we're just going to see her in a swimsuit posing off with her hair and makeup done. No, I want you to see me when I'm out with my girls having fun. You know, you get to see me in my elements and how I wore the swimsuits, which is the real deal. So stay tuned, guys. Thanks for watching my video. And I will try to post more a little more often. I'd say three, at least three times a week to keep you guys updated on how my hauls are going, life, makeup, hair, anything you want to know, baby, I got you. So stay tuned, guys.